another fun-filled video with Karen Zima. Today, very excited to be doing a pet portrait. Pet portraits, you can make a ton of money if you know how to do them. Uh, everybody likes their pet painted. Um, in fact, if you want a pet portrait, contact me and I will paint whatever you want. So, uh, just heads up on that. Uh, this guy's name is Charlie. He's done on 24 by 30 inch. Uh, he's done in acrylics on canvas. Stay tuned. I'll show you all my tips and tricks and how I created Charlie. I can do it. You can do it. So stay tuned. And today we're going to do something different. It's going to be a dog portrait. I haven't done one of those yet in any of my videos, so I'm going to do one today for you. And this lovely creature is either a bloodhound or a basset hound, something like that. He's very adorable. They're so odd looking that it makes them cute. And he is particularly cute. So follow along and I'll show you how I create this. Okay, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the background yet, but I just wanted to get a layer of color in so I can start drying. And then I'll probably make it like blues, because blues go pretty nice with browns and beiges of the dog. It'll be lighter blue, but we just put that in right now so it's a dry, and I'll start working on what I like to start on first, the dog's eyes. I like to start on eyes first. Alright, so. I put out some of these colors, so. It's like a burnt umber, like a burnt sienna, some white, some gold for his eyes, maybe some orange tones and browns, maybe some purples in there. So, let's start out with the eye. Underneath the eye, put the world in there. Put a little yellow in there. Okay. Okay, let's go around the top of the eye with the dark black. Go around up there. And then he's going to have those big, soft, cuddly looking eyes. He's going to be looking up all side. Well, it's not side, but it's just it's the way they kind of look. They look side. It's going to be. Looks like he's looking up already. So, his eye color is going to be this chocolate, chocolate color. So let's put a brown right kind of around the bottom part of it. Okay, looks good. And then we're going to go and get some gold, gold and yellow. I'm just going to put that in, let it dry, and blend it a little first.
background. Mm -hmm. the, the dog is dark, so I have to have that dark blue for a second layer of color. The lighter blue right over. It's a matter of what you have. Just a little blue. Not a lot of
did for me. All right, I think I'm done with this. Sit back and take a look, see if there's any areas that need work. I'm very pleased with it. Uh, this guy's name is Charlie, as you already know. <laughs> so uh, if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to leave a comment. Love reading your comments. So you guys keep on practicing. And until next time, bye-bye.